Hey everybody, this is Joby, and today I wanted to do something a little bit different. I wanted to show you guys a secret quest, sort of. Not really a secret, but it is something that it's uh, difficult to find. What it is, a hidden merchant. Now, where we are is in Stone Falls. We are at uh, Soft Loam Cavern Door. It's just Delve. And this is the Ashen Robe Way Shrine, or you could come to uh, Sulphur Pools, and you just come over here. If you don't have it, it's in between the Lover, the Boss, Davina's Farm, and then these Way Shrines over here, and this uh, Sulphur Pools, Sulphur Pools Way Shrine, and Ashen Road. Okay, and then all you need to do is just ride this way, kind of a uh, northwest, and then you'll be here. Now, we're not going to go inside of the Soft Lone Cavern. What we're going to do is... We're going to head over north, and then we're going to take this little road right here. See this? Some place where nobody would go. And then you just turn here. It looks like there's nothing here. And then there's Zashur, the merchant. So I want to talk to Zashur. What are you doing here? And he's just got a store. No matter, I have goods to trade. There are trifles except for that odd statue. Okay, so he's telling you, see, just the normal stuff. think everything's... Uh, kosher but then religious fetish statue do you dare buy it i do dare so it says i don't meet the purchase requirements oh that's because i don't have any money because <laughs> i already bought it so it's a quest starter it's bind on pickup and what you do then is you just go over here go to your inventory and i think it's in uh is it in supplies or is it in quest items? I have to, to look to see. There it is. Now, all you have to do to start the quest is press A. I wonder where this came from. This fetish car from Obsidian depicts an exaggerated female figure. The figure is marred by jagged slashes and the edges are sharp enough to draw blood. It's unclear if the gashes are intentional or, or the product of poor craftsmanship. So he asked, you wonder where you, this came from? And that starts a quest called the fetish. Find someone to identify the statue. And then you want to ask uh, Zashur about the statue. So let's go ahead and ask him. Where did this come from, dude? Okay, it's on the slope of the volcano. And have you seen anything like it before? My people find them in the ways who could identify this. And then they say, I couldn't even begin to guess. So... What I would think to do is to go ahead and go to your journal, right here, quests, all right, and then we look at the quest, the fetish, okay, and he said occasionally these statues are buried. What I'll do is I'll go ahead and press X, and then it tells me to go to Cragamore. Put a marker there, and Cragamore is right down here. Now, I'm not going to do the rest of this quest, kind of creepy, and uh, I want you guys to get the full adventure of it. I know... Uh, some people don't really like questing and maybe you won't want to do it and that's fine if you don't. But if you're kind of bored and, you know, want to do something that's uh, interesting, maybe you can come do this quest, check it out and uh, you'll get more. See, this game, the base game is um, a lot more fleshed out than the other stuff. Uh, there's flashier stuff in the new DLCs and in the new expansions, but actually the base game, the lore and the involvement in the quests are all way deeper. Uh, of course, the you know graphics and stuff in the base game aren't as good as in the the new parts of the game. I, I kind of feel sorry for people that just start off and then like we had Blackwood as the last expansion and then they they did the tutorial and they just landed in Blackwood and they started doing that and they didn't really know anything about the base game because uh, although it doesn't look as good, it's I think the stories are all much much better. Cadwell's gold and silver and you know, the three alliances and all that about the Alliance War, Imperial City. All that stuff is amazing. And uh, you can do a quest here. Maybe run around in Stone Falls until we get the, the new expansion. The new expansion will drop next week. And um, me personally, uh, I'm very excited for it. But I passed the 1,000 quest achievement three years ago. So I've done many, many, many quests. I love it. I love to quest. And... Uh, I will do that. And actually, I love everything in the game. I like PvP. I like uh, questing. I like uh, dungeons and trials and all that. It's uh, very fun to me. So I do it all. But that's really about it. This is the place to go. If you look on the map, I'll show you where I am exactly. It's a little bit up from Soft Loam Cavern. 
And that's all you need to do is run up this hill and you can find our good friend Zashur. And uh, he will still be here even after the quest is over. And you can always come and get some potions and stuff if you're dueling down there in the hole. Well, that's really about it for today. So please, give me a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed the content. And leave a comment in the comment section and tell me what do you like about the game. Do you like to uh, quest? Do you like to PvE? Like dungeons, trials? Do you like to run around with your friends? Do you like companions? I always want to know what people like. Like I said, I do everything. So... I enjoy it all. I think it's an amazing game. And the social aspect is uh, incredible. Are you in a guild? That's what I want to know. Do you like to be in guilds? I would certainly suggest that that would be my first suggestion to anybody that started playing this game. Join me on Discord, the most chill Discord server on the planet. There's a link in the description. And if you're not doing anything, 8.15 p.m. Eastern Time, follow me on Twitch. Upper Echelon Mediocrity is the name of the channel. I have a lot of fun in there. Run around do all kinds of stuff. If you're on Xbox North American server, you can join my guild. My guild's name is Upper Echelon Mediocrity, just like the YouTube channel. Right now we have 484 total members, no members pending, and 25 people online. The closer it gets to the expansion, the less people are going to come online. People are, I guess they feel anxiety and stuff. You know, the people that join and then have never really, are not planning on getting the expansion are probably in here running around doing stuff, not even talking to people, you know. It's like the Skyrim Online or something, although it's not. It's really not. It's very different. But all the vet players, most of them, or at least a lot of them, they're just taking it easy. Uh, my one friend, Dew, is he's off. He, uh, he took off to California to go do some music. Good on you, brother. Hope you're doing well. And um, a lot of people are, you know, it's kind of a lull, but it's going to get live in here when the new expansion drops, even if you're not... Uh, going to buy the expansion if you want to join the guild and come play people will help you out um, we're not the guild finder so you need to send me a message on xbox my name is coyote c-h-a-o-t-e-y and i'll get you in as soon as time permits all right so until that time let's get paid